this week, my own popular opinion is <coughs> Wayne Rooney. <laughs> hang on, hang on. Wayne, Wayne Rooney. Rooney uh-huh. Wayne Rooney breaking the England goal record yeah. means nothing. He scored goals against San Marino and Latvia. Overhyped, and it was embarrassing how the media and the world overhyped another English achievement. <laughs> uh, so, so, Man United fans, hey, cut the music, cut the music. what do you have to say? Wayne start. Rooney. Now, you know what? Yo, Zach, drop an interlude. Um, the interlude. Yeah, yo, it's mad. <laughs> yeah, damn right it's mad. Damn right it's mad. <laughs> All safe, yo, listen, Rooney. <laughs> okay, Christian, do you think he's that good? Do you, do you, do you think he's worthy of that um, accolade? Uh, yeah, he scored the goals, didn't he? Yeah, honest, but it, it, you can only play what's in front of you. You know, and, like, um, however, it is Latvia and San Marino. Yep. But then again, they're professional football teams. Yeah, um, James? I'm not really his biggest fan at the moment, um, but I think I don't think you can just say he scored against crap teams because teams were a lot easier back in the day when Bobby but Charlton and people. How are many? Brain, how many of those goals were World Cup goals? How many of those yeah. goals were Euro goals? Those, my, that's my, that's Game my winning point. goals. Yo, can fair I, enough question. All right, Keenan? so t- your unpopular opinion. You said Rooney. The goals mean nothing. Obviously, it doesn't because a goal is a goal. And what those goals in England have enabled enabled him to do, which is more important than the national team, is perform for United. So now he's won, he's won us some trophies, man. Uh, he's, and and look at if you look at the number of goals, if you look at the number of goals that he, Rooney has scored for us, and the position he played in, Rooney played in the number ten. And if you look at the players we signed, and all like we've we've signed a new number ten since Rooney's been in this club, but all of none of them lasted because they couldn't move Rooney out of that spot. Well, and no, that's no, not no. fluke. R- that's R- not Rooney's fluke. been moved from spot to box. Like, no, R- 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 but, sorry, sorry, hang but on, he's still, second, he's still the main Ronaldo, man. When Cristiano Ronaldo came, wasn't mm. Rooney playing on what, the but left? No, the right? I'd, I'd still left. argue with Ronaldo. I still argue with Ronaldo that if Rooney wasn't now, I don't think Ronaldo would have scored as many goals as he did. Rooney, Rooney is so selfless in that mm. he let other people play. True. Everyone's True. allowed to play but the listen, game. We're not talking about that. We're about England. Yeah, my Chris, yeah, he does the same thing for England too. But England's crap. He's had a lot of big. He's played a lot of big teams. Rooney for England. Yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna go back to Portugal. He's played Germany. He's that, who else has he played? I mean like was Portugal when he kicked um Cavallo in the nuts. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, like I mean, did he score it's, against all the seasons? Nah, but my my argument is isn't our uh, Rooney's which does, he, it, does he basically score in big games yeah, d- for England? Who no, scores in big games for England? Yeah, Please yeah, just tell me. Yeah, but, but, but hang on, but Rooney Rooney's this like guy we've like built up to be like No, like, Rooney's I mean, the the rock of like Exactly. Flipping. <laughs> yeah, that's because you pin team. your hopes on him because it's obvious, it's evident, clearly Another. evident that he's the best player in England. So then yeah, he should be then banging in the goals against the major teams. But it's a, yeah, it's um, over. It's a overhyped. It's true. It might be a bit. I don't know if it's overhyped, but I want to compare it to Ronaldo for Portugal. Mm-hmm. Like, if you look at Ronaldo in big tournaments, he doesn't blitz tournaments for <laughs> Portugal. Doesn't teams, but teams bad around him. It's the same thing as Rooney that, with England. Much. That's what I think. Yeah, but like, England haven't had a bad team. Yes, they have. Man for man. No, man for man. There's some England some stages. Of, England are poor. England, England, and real as a nation, England, 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 England are poor. We can't poor keep really the ball. Though, no, on they, paper, England are a really good team. But I'd say, I'd just say, England were not poor because they had that golden generation. Yeah, Lampard, Scholes. Our our defense was good. You can see how depleted. Premier it League is. and Champions After League winning Ferdinand defenses and, and, and Terry's have retired. Though. Yeah, but on paper, it's a good team. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't matter. Like, it, yeah, like, it I said, like I said before, I'm an it- Italy fan now, so... <laughs> England are just yeah. <laughs> done with them. How, how, how do you play in a team that has no chemistry? How? Like how? No, that's the, that's part that's of that. That's what you train together for, though. That's fault. What, whose fault is that? No, that's not Rooney's fault. That's not Rooney's fault. Exactly. He's well, it is Rooney's fault that he's scoring six different managers. How long has Jochen Lowe been at um, Germany for? Uh, um, my question is, how many World Cups has Rooney played and how many goals has he scored? I don't know. So like he he, play, he got rushed into it into a scored, tournament when he was injured. He scored his first one. How old was he? He's been to. I he's only he's only really had one national been to, tournament. I think and that was last year. About Actually, three or four World Cups. In 2010, his highlight was of the World Cup was um, having a rant at the camera. Yeah, listen, and at that age he was I think 25 so that's in the pri- in his prime what did Messi do in that World Cup hmm? what did Messi do in that World Cup um, wait, wait, you're comparing Lionel Messi to oh, Wayne Rooney you're talking about international footballers yeah, yeah? I don't think, yeah, yeah but Messi, Messi's Messi has already made up for his World Cup failures because he scored four no, no, in the no, last no, no, one no, no. I, I, four, no, 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 I don't think that's a good enough argument I think yo in terms of goals Messi has scored World Cup goals mm-hmm. Messi has scored Copa, Copa America goals Messi scored international goals Rooney has been scoring against teams like 
Paraguay, Jamaica, Trinidad and Tobago, and he's got this <laughs> overhyped achievement. People are handing him this gold. Should and be so, ashamed so, it's so, going gold. This yeah. is why I think Ronaldo is a better example because Portugal aren't great like England, and Ronaldo doesn't deliver. He doesn't really deliver at World Cups like he does for well, England. Think, so it's the same thing. Ronaldo. His team isn't great around him, but he scored. I think he's nearly Portugal's highest. Yeah, so is Rooney. Ronaldo's probably scored against lesser yeah, really, teams. Yeah, Ronaldo is the highest. Scorer, yeah, so I think it's what, the same thing. What really. I think Farhan was trying to get out of his unpopular opinion is that Rooney's not getting the same respect as say Gary Lineker gets because yeah. he was one goal yeah. behind him. Bobby mm. Charlton, yeah. he'll never get the same respect as him, no. even though he's got more goals. That's what he's trying to say. Yeah, in like the modern day and age, like football fans are, in my opinion, overhyped. And you know what? I'm gonna criticize myself here. Arsenal fans, they're like one of the examples, they're overhyped. And I Who think we overhyped. No, 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 I don't think. <laughs> that's just, uh, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not on about me and you, I'm that's just on about like the, no, like, I know. Like the general gist of things. And to overhype such an achievement of like breaking the goal, goal records. I mean, like, think about, can you think about one or two really important goals that Rooney scored for England? No. Qualifying? You, you, oh, you say reason about that. Yeah, but you're saying qualifying. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. Qualifying is like. I think well, it's. I think it's harsh. What you, who else is gonna score? I think How it's harsh. What you're saying about Wayne Rooney personally. I think. So I think even. All right. He's, we can all agree he's not been at his best form the past couple yeah. of seasons. He's yeah. not been playing well. Yeah. But when he first broke out into the scene when he was like 16, 17 and playing in the Euros, he did score in the Euros. Yeah. To be fair to him. Yeah, and I know. All right. He hasn't scored in every competition he's played in. Listen. But. 50 goals speaks for itself. I don't think you're listening. Do you, do you guys, <laughs> do you no. guys think he's been able to handle the pressure? Nah, listen, listen. I, I, really, Rooney, I don't see. I don't. I think, I, I, think I, I don't agree with this one. I, I mean, I don't really like Wayne Rooney at the minute because he plays for United and he's, uh, he's not playing well. But he has scored 50 see, goals for England over yeah. the course see, over my a counter, good career. My right counter England. argument to that is: Where was he in the World Cup? And you it's know mad. what? It's mad. It's mad. Yeah, it is mad because. Their yeah, group, he had a bad. Their, he did have a bad World Cup. Their group was hard. Yeah, exactly. Their group was hard, but then. You'd expect Wayne Rooney, world-class Manchester United striker, wait, to score goals. Wait, 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 my wait. biggest like pain with Wayne Rooney is he burst onto the scene at Euro 2004, scored all those goals, and he's never really done it again. Like he just so it, he annoys it, me is, because is, he hasn't. Is he, he hasn't, world, is he world class or just a one? He hasn't. Under? He's a good player, but he hasn't fulfilled <laughs> his potential. Put it that way. That's what annoys me about him. Just yeah. So you're saying he burst onto the scene in Euro 2004 and he hasn't done much since then. He scored 50 goals since then. What I'm saying is, is how, how is he broken? What, what, sorry, what I, what I mean, what David Bentley's a one-hit wonder. But what Farhan saying is that do those goals matter? The goals, goals he scored. Yeah, are they goals? Are they goals that you're gonna remember? Matter in terms of like matter, like say like we play Spain. Muller's probably got less goals than him internationally, and you can already see how many like what how how much of an effect he's had. Honestly, you could remember them. Rooney is like the biggest anticlimax. England has ever seen. Yeah, why is that? You, why you, is that? Because he started so high, and then after Euro 2004, he just put it this nah. way: him and Ronaldo were level. Nah. They were level for yeah, United. That is, that yeah, is him and Ronaldo were level for United. Ronaldo's gone on to become a legend of the game. Three Ballon d'Ors, and where's where's Rooney? That's because Rooney stayed in England. Listen, okay. the thing about it, wait, wait, that, that wait, 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 pause, pause, pause. If Rooney moved out of England, I think he would have won it a lot more, and I think he would have had a lot more respect. Gary Lineker moved, didn't he? See, um, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Wait, even Suarez. Okay, Suarez so I, I don't think that's a barometer. Wait, wait, the second Suarez left English football, he was slated in the media. It's the same, like media yeah. and English players. We don't mix, man. So we you're just saying wanna, the media we, is constantly for yeah, Rooney yeah, not reaching yeah, his potential because we constantly attack our players. You don't give them a chance to like grow. Listen, if they, if if for our form, you don't you like you don't stick with them. I think you're still it's just, it's so aggressive. And like, even still, wait, wait, even still, even still, a nation. A nation pins their hopes on someone who's apparently crap and they're going to do the same thing this tournament as well even though he's having an awful season and he's not the same Rooney as before. They're still going to pin their hopes, uh, hopes wait, on him. Wait. This is and why they shouldn't play Rooney next year so we don't have that problem. He's still misunderstanding my point here. I think Esmond said it earlier. What I'm trying to say is, do you think... Yeah, your answer's do, no. No, 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 wait, wait. <laughs> do you, no, I'm asking all three of you, all Van Gaal's army, yeah? Do you think <laughs> these Rooney goals that got him this overhyped achievement, which will be remembered for years. I mean, it was a massive thing. Until someone breaks it. Yeah, until someone breaks it. Like I who? don't know who, exactly who. Well, That's what someone will come up. Who, who, <laughs> Someone will come who, up. I don't know nah, who. who, who. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But There's until, no one now. <laughs> but listen, does he deserve that respect on an international level? And I think no. But I think he's, I, I, I'm not, I'm not Rooney's, I haven't been Rooney's biggest fan for a couple of years. I don't really. You can tell, can't you? Like I've said it before, how his decline mm. and stuff like that. 
but you have to give the man respect for what he's done. There's no, you can say he's only scored penalties and stuff like that in qualifying, but you're telling me that, that, that there's another player on the pitch that, for England that would have stepped up and had the confidence to bury a goal that's going to get three points. In, <coughs> when you need Steven it and stuff like it. that. Frank <laughs> Lampard would have done it. Yeah. Paul yeah, Scholes would have done Lampard, it. But like, and you can't say there, he's not like, had a good team he, for he, England. Whoever said, whoever said he's not had a good team for That's England can't say that because, I know, all right, they might not have had the best chemistry, but on paper, yeah. England's team at one point was mad. Ashley Cole, yeah. Rio Ferdinand, John Terry, Gary Neville, Rooney and Michael Owen up front, Gerard Lampard, Scholes. It was a good team. I think, yeah, I think, you can't say he's not I had think a good the team main issue with Rooney is not what he's done, he's that he could have done more. Yeah. For me, like he could, he he like he's got a brilliant. And, and what he's broken a record. Is that, that though? Yeah, he's broken years. a record. What more like, could he do? What what can he do? Because if you're that's saying that, James, he obviously that's where James taps into what I'm saying. He was he on the same something. level yeah, yeah. as Ronaldo, and look where Ronaldo is now. But that doesn't mean that Wayne he Rooney hasn't is. done a lot. No, it like, doesn't mean he has done a lot. He has done a lot. He has no. He has done a lot. Obviously, he's he's achieved a lot. But I'm saying he could have achieved a lot more. Listen, Esmond, I want you to go around and ask everybody. As an England international, does Rooney deserve the recognition that he has, the respect that he's got? But no, Why even not? when he broke the record, Sky Sports and the media were still saying, is he still England's yeah. most respected high school? Yeah, but still, they overhyped the celebration. Oh, they no saying, one, no one, no it wasn't that yeah, hype. But the reason they did hype it was because obviously it's a long standing record. Yeah. But I, I also saw in the media that they were like, they were asking questions like, oh, is he still England's greatest ever player, even though he broke the record? Yeah. They were still tearing into him. But of course, that's just 49 what the year media record do to Rooney, so yeah, don't that's, they? That's like, that's opinions on it. But I'm trying to say is, I don't no, think he deserves, the, yeah, yeah, I, don't, I agree with you. I just don't think he deserves the respect on that level, if I'm honest with you. So what do you reckon? So his, J Jacob, like, <laughs> do, you, do you think Rooney re deserves respect at international level? Yeah, yeah, of course he does because he has been in this team for for years, and he's always gone, he's going to be there till he leaves international football. Let's be honest, as much as he shouldn't be, he is going to be. So you got to you got to respect him. He scored goals, and he's okay. good good for United and everything. So, All right, Mesty. I mean, inside England, yeah, but outside, worldwide, probably no. Oh, okay. And the other countries are probably looking at him. Ah, oh, he's broke their country's record, mm. but they haven't done anything. Yeah, mm. Zach. Um. What was the question again? Uh, does he re deserve respect at international uh, level? I think he mm, he does, obviously, because he's England's highest ever goal scorer. But yeah. um, I just think, like ten years down the line, when people like uh, he won't be people like probably Harry Kane, you won't be mentioning. I don't know. You won't be mentioning Rain, Rain, Wayne Rooney in the same like tone and adulation as you mentioned Messi Ronaldo you know why I say mm. no because when you think of England England international strikers like Michael Owen who I think he's did he score past Argentina no one talks about no, him no no I'm just saying I'm just saying I'm just Danny saying Danny Welbeck I'm just, <laughs> I forgot he existed but listen I'm just saying he scored past Argentina right mm. yeah People look at that goal and think that was a sick goal. I forgot. You don't think about Equi England equivalent goal. to like David Beckham's goal when he scored against Greece. Keenan's mentality just shows you what's wrong because he does not rate Michael Owen, but he rates Wayne Rooney. Nah, nah, Owen's Owen Owen United legend. Owen, Owen's United legend. What? <laughs> <laughs> James, let's move on to James. Yeah. Um, does he deserve <laughs> so respect at international um, level? He scored. Oh, of course he does. Of course he does. It's ridiculous. He's he's scored fifty goals at international le level for England. Friendlies in competitions in qualifying. You um just said Harry Kane. Mm. I said this a few weeks, probably at the start of the pods. At this time, I think he. I'm saying he has Harry, potential. Yeah, he to doesn't because at this point in Harry Kane's career, by now Rooney had already scored something like smashing. Ten, but but, ten, but, in, all, but in all him. but in all honesty, Harry Kane's been a slow burner. Exactly. In, ter in terms of like we're looking at superstars who have Harry won Kane the kids from score, age 19. Harry Kane will probably end up scoring about 15 goals for England. I think 15. It's You've got to look. How many Rooney, he scored so Rooney, far? He's Rooney was scoring. He's double digits. Nearly two. double digits. He's already got two in like two, three yeah. internationals. And nearly by that double. time, Wayne Rooney had scored about 14, 15. But every career so that's different. It's, yeah. It's, but but you, you've, you've got to think like, like who, Harry um, Kane. There's a there's a graph like the graph like how many he can score now. Okay, but like, put it this way: if Harry Kane, okay, put it this way: say what you said happens and Harry Kane scores ten goals for England, but he scores six of them in at the World Cup or something. Yeah. Would your opinion change? Okay, it'd, it'd be good, wouldn't it? If Harry Kane, if Harry, if Harry Kane scored six goals at a World Cup or five goals at the Euros, and we went on to the semi-finals, he's. I would. I would agree with the fact that he's done more for England than Wayne Rooney in some respects. 
Like it's exactly. It, it, but I'm not saying that's hypothetical. That's if yeah, that this happens. This is all hypothetical. If it do, it? Yeah, yeah. That, that's, that's the argument. That's the it's argument. Like Rooney really hasn't had that impact right. on any tournament. I might get called up by England tomorrow and score ten goals. I don't know. All right, yeah. Keenan. Yeah. Keenan. Okay, yeah, yeah. Like Jake. Jacob provided some nice context there. I like that. I like that idea. <laughs> um, but still, though, I think Rooney. Do you respect him at international level? I've Rooney deserves more respect than he's getting. I agree. Yeah. Why? Because like you, you have to appreciate what a player has done for this. His country man just in terms of football itself what has he done he's broken a world record and you live to see that exactly like it's, it's his performance it's thank you yo hold on i i was, I was, I was coming we got we got an audience member yeah 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 yeah, yeah. Come, come on. <laughs> contribute, what contribute. Say, what he said was football. It's not all about goals, but it is all about goals because that's what the net's no, there for. Goals, yeah. yeah, and, and well, he, so, he broke so that record. Wait, wait, wait. If it's about goals, then wait, what? Then what we arguing about? Give me a second. <laughs> <laughs> that's the <laughs> argument, though. That is the argument. Does he deserve respect as yeah, an England international deserves, striker? He deserves more. Nah, he doesn't. Of course, he doesn't. He deserves right, let's move on to Christian. I've said he deserves respect as an England player. In it. I beg you to speak to the mic. Listen, <laughs> listen, the record he broke wasn't for the most respected England international. That doesn't exist. The record he broke was for the goals. And the goals mean nothing because he was scoring past Latvia, San Marino, Trinidad, he and Jamaica. Scoring and Jamaica. Also, his last four goals to break the record were penalties. If it was so easy, everyone True. in his generation yeah. should be scoring 50. Yeah, but... Yeah, but <sighs> yeah, why doesn't... That's, that's... Can't hear your question, sorry. Oh, no, I don't know. I just think... Rooney just gets no respect. Okay. I don't know. I don't know whether it's his personality or Van, what it is, but Rooney doesn't seem to get respect from money, the English. Van, nah, nah, because Van Persie. Other, put it this way. I get Fine's point because Van Persie scored fifty international goals for Holland way before Rooney did. He's our highest ever goal scorer, and no one ever talks about him like that. Like he's still not considered one of our ever like greatest players. Mm. Doesn't mean. And in reply to Christian, I do That's respect Wayne Rooney as a footballer. I thought he was amazing for United for, I'd say, four seasons running. <laughs> four, yeah. four, maybe, maybe <laughs> more than that. Maybe he more scored than that. how I'm many goals? Like two hundred and something. I'm only, I'm, only, I'm only saying that hypothetically because I'm not gonna go into Wayne Rooney fan club. <laughs> but I respect him as a footballer, but as an England international striker, I think his achievement was overhyped. And as an England international, I think he didn't do anything for them. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to agree with Farhan there, and uh, yes. on that you note, I, yeah, I agree with Farhan. <laughs> I, I, I agree, agree with Farhan. what he just said as a statement. Yeah. To be fair, it does make sense. I but, mean, uh, he has scored fifty. This is coming from this is coming. Sorry, this is coming from an Arsenal fan who does really respect Rooney, but so international what? level. <laughs> you know what? The thing is, there were times where international during level, his I'm, England I'm career, sure he was playing as a ten. So yeah. and he, he has been moved goals. around so much. But then again, he's still he's playing as a ten. That boils down to team. again. But he's no him. one rates Wayne Rooney as a striker because no one has played him there throughout matter. his whole career. Hold on, hold it. There might be a better striker than Rooney. Okay, might like, be there. Martial, definitely Martial is. proved that that is a better striker no, than Rooney. Saying, but but what I'm saying is, he still carries the team. Like he, does, he, does he, he still he, he still so carries much. that team. You think? Yeah, any, no, no. I respect, I respect that. If Rooney was in that team, you think anyone like could just come in? Wait, so and score score right freely? now? Right now, when Rooney carries the England team, hmm? right, right now, that's a myth. Right now, I don't know who England are playing. We'll see in the weekend. Though. I don't think if say if say He's say, scoring, say England are playing Slovakia. Say they've got a match against Slovakia next week. That if Wayne Rooney's on the sheet, they're going to be worried. It's they're going to go. Like oh we got who's we playing against Harry Kane oh, okay okay but, but then yeah. they're gonna be thinking oh don't concede a, a pen like he's gonna he, score he adds more than just he's 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 got the top goal he's got this aura around he add, him, yeah. he's adds more than just goals though okay hypothetically let's say that yeah, but yeah. in the Euros if Germany play England and they see Wayne Rooney on the score sheet they're just gonna think this is England and we're gonna win four nil uh, that's that's, that's, that's so how goal. come how, how how come Messi said recently that Rooney is world class is Messi in the dugout. No, 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 it's like me saying because real recognize real. he knows he knows <laughs> uh, okay listen <laughs> messi knows everyone respects rooney and by him saying that but they don't obviously, respect rooney, obviously no they do because rooney does get respect all right all right let, let's go around one one worded answer Wait, can we open it up to club level i mean we're, we're no, already no, like no, a, an hour no. an hour like 
past this. That was not my unpopular opinion. Abs again just said Chelsea and Barcelona wanted Rooney at one point. Um, Chelsea, just he said Chelsea and Arsenal, and we didn't want. Didn't Mourinho wait, bid thirty million wait, or something? What has this got to do with his international that achievements? Point in them, I think. Wait, yeah. exactly, <laughs> Esmond. Ask the, ask the ask the dogger. What's this got to do with his international yeah. achievements? Do countries bid for other players? I mean, his international achievements are that he's the greatest <laughs> goal scorer ever. ever for a country. Which has to have some sort of merit. Yeah. Which and I think that's embarrassing. Which is All the right. most underachieving country in international football. All right, in a in one Europe. word, I'll go around no, and we'll finish it there. Hello. I'll go around. Do you respect <laughs> Rooney's international achievements? Yes or no? Yes. Jacob. Yes. Mus? What was the question, sir? <laughs> Do you respect Rooney's international achievements? Yes or no? Yes. Zach? To some extent. Yes and yeah, no. <laughs> okay. Um, go on. Uh, no, and if you're listening, I don't want to get slapped. <laughs> yes. Name me a better English player. Y- yes or no? Yes. <laughs> yes. 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 And Christian? Yes. Well, then uh, it's decided. We respect Rooney. Anyway, uh, <laughs> <laughs> thank you for listening to another Dugout episode. Uh, pop-